afternoon. Michigan Medicine is getting a major boost to research uh, the benefits of convalescent plasma in milder COVID-19 infections. Researchers from U of M, Stanford, the University of Pittsburgh, and the Medical University of South Carolina will receive $7 million in government funding to answer a key question about this promising treatment. Most of the other studies are focused on people who are so sick that they need to be in the ICU. Um, and our study question is, um, as soon as you're diagnosed with this illness, can we give you um, convalescent plasma and prevent you from developing um, a very severe case of this disease? Dr. Fred Corley is one of the principal researchers at Michigan Medicine. He says convalescent plasma donated by survivors contains antibodies that can bind to the coronavirus and neutralize it. Our hope is that if we can get to the patient early enough, then with convalescent plasma, we can neutralize the virus before the virus does a lot of damage um, to the body. The study will enroll ER patients that have mild COVID symptoms, but a high risk for developing severe complications. We're looking for people who are over 50 years old, people who have comorbidities like hypertension, diabetes, heart problems, people who are immunocompromised, people who are obese, and people who have sickle cell disease. Researchers hope to have results by early November. Oh, I think is uh, absolutely critical uh, because the more treatments we have, uh, the less afraid we'll be of, of this illness. Michigan hospitals enrolling patients in the study will include Spectrum Health, Detroit Receiving, Harper Hospital, Sinai Grace, and Henry Ford. Researchers say it's also critical for survivors to donate convalescent plasma to treat current patients and aid in studies like theirs.